He's going to try to go for me. That last corner. Shit. Or right here. Got an inside pass line. Inside, but get, get on the throttle. Here we go. Mitch, seriously, for the fuck's sakes, dude, this is a club race. Like, fuck, man. That move was douchebag, dude. You fucking pulled the stupid move, Mitch. I like you, but dude, what the fuck was that? You knew I had that corner blocked. Fucking buddy. Inside, but get, get on the throttle. Here we go. Oh. Shit. You fucking asshole. Or right here. Got an inside pass line. Side, but get, get on the throttle. Here we go. Oh. Shit. You fucking asshole.
That was. I knew he was gonna try to pass me there. I knew it, right? Oh yeah. Because that's his best spot every time I race him. So I just went in really fast and then took a tight line. I was already in the entry and then he smashed me, right? Like he didn't have a chance. He way overdid his. What's the what's the, the word in MotoGP? You uh, ran on talent. Your, 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 uh, what was it? His ambition outweighed his talent. His ambition outweighed his talent this time. <laughs> As we celebrate the podium finishers for this race, what a finish to it, holy cow. Adam led, lap to lap. We'll hear his race story. Marcel had second for a little bit, Mar Mitchell came back, and then Marcel got him back, and then Mitchell unfortunately tossed it down in turn nine. Hill. Marcel had one heck of a save to keep the bike upright and still finish in the box. Volga came through, what a stud charging from clear in the back, a hard charge reward. On a borrowed bike even, that's what a stud you are. So. Let's get these guys up here, way to go. We're having a good one back there, doing 24s back, and then the last lap, something happened. Tell us about it, and you're a stud for keeping it up. Way to go. Yeah, I was, that uh, ABS was stopping me again. Remember, ABS saved the day back at the ridge off turn one. <laughs> you know, had a decent start, just uh, laid off the clutch and um, settled in behind Adam. And I, I knew you were gonna pull some 22s, and I'm like, my goal this weekend was my Lorenzo comeback, hashtag. <laughs> You know, Lorenzo, he broke his back, he came back, he just wanted to get used to the bike. So that was my plan this weekend. All yesterday I was training, uh, doing my rider training on the Ninja 400, so then to jump into FP1 and get on this, like, hyper bike was insane. The onboard commentary, you'll see, it's, I'm out of control. Yeah. That's a lot different than the 400. Follow my line. And then stand up and brake. Just a little bit of brake, it's nothing really. We're just braking like 10%. And uh, anyways, came back, qualified second. It was a little moist out there. That was really tough on me, but uh, you know, I really want to be safe out here. I just took two months off of work because of my broken thumb. Four skips. Living the retired life. Can't really skip with my thumb. <laughs> All right, here we go. Boondocking. This is a 400 stop. Whoa! Spins out the rear. Up the third. And his left. Drag! What are we doing? 88 kilometers. Whoa! Head shake. There's no steering damper on this thing. It does get a head shake on extreme circumstances, which happened to have a lot of extreme circumstances. <laughs> Halfway hot spring! Come on! Like, whoa! Sh dodge the rocks! Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, yeah, on the brake! Oh yeah, look at I run the inside lane, I can go way faster track-wise. Wow. How awesome is this? What a boondocking spot. Top 10. Nice little landing right down to my own personal beach. Beautiful river. 
Just epic. What's up? Ah, oh, shoot. Yeah, I think I can make it. Dirt bike ninja full honey. Oh yeah. Well, there's stumps everywhere I gotta watch out for. Sick. But, uh, you know, I really want to be safe out here. I just took two months off of work because of my broken thumb. And in the race, so Mitch came up on me, um, Mitchell Pierce, and he passed me in that exact spot. And he's passed me there in previous rounds. So I knew that was his best spot. Like coffee, he crashed out and destroyed his bike right there. Hurt himself too a little bit, but he's okay. Oh, guys, look at this. That's not good. Turn five. Coffee beat the shit out of his bike in a bad crash. Is he okay? Where is he? Oh, he didn't go to the hospital. It wasn't that bad. Mostly the bike. Yeah, but you know, shit, shit. Sorry to see, man. Nobody likes to fucking see this shit. It's horrible. Horrible. Yikes. And a tight corner. I gotta get on the gas board so I don't just coast so much there. Use front tire. SC2. Whoa! A little sketchy on my turning timing. I gotta chase now. Third is good though. I'll wait. Who knows what he's doing? He's quick here. I'll give you guys a video race, huh? Yeah, buddy! Woo! Love it! So I knew that was his best spot, and I was been practicing getting better. And you know, then he had a bike issue, and I got back by him. And I knew on the last lap, that's exactly where he was going to try to pass me. So I ripped in there as fast as I could, trail break the tightest line possible. I'm like, yeah, I have it. Boom, he smashed into the back of me. And we were like together, locked in, and then luckily, Head's bike let go of mine. And now I'm like, ABS all the way to the fence weeds. And I'm like, shit, turn around. I drive out of the weeds now. And I see, I'm like, oh crap, I'm, I want to hold on a second. Dirty tires layer in the bus stop, and then we had a red flag. And uh, wow, that was intense, guys. The footage will be crazy. I want to thank everybody who's ever supported me. It's great to see so many Canadians on the podium, let alone some old <laughs> friends. John, it's good to see you back on the track, you know. And, Oh, sorry, guys. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> thank you to everybody. You know, the Pirellis work decent. I love that shit. Uh, all Pirelli, all BMW, all Canadian podiums. That's pretty Woo! cool. Marcel took all my time, so I got to keep it short. I just wanted, uh, You've been up here enough. I'll uh, give a longer one here at the end of the day, but uh, just thanks everyone for watching. Sounds like I missed all the excitement on second, third there. I kind of wish I had saw that. But uh, anyway, we'll all see you guys later on tonight, and we'll we'll do a proper. Well, John, to all of you guys, and as uh, Carol, the owner of Motor Vixen, hands out the checks that she sponsors this class for Robarts, taking home a thousand bucks. Holy shit, a lot of dust. I always miss the excitement. Can you go back to the beginning? Because that's where it's all. Holy one shit. Back, one more yeah, back. the bike hooked onto me. One more back. I mean, okay, that's, well, that's it? Start. Yeah. Oh, uh, we don't really get much from this. Of what happened originally. It's amazing that he missed you, that he didn't take you out. Because he hit my shoulder.
All right. I'm getting soaked. I'm out of here. Back to the home on wheels.